Good afternoon. My name is Thomas Lopez Pierre, and I am the president and CEO of the Black Real Estate Forum LLC and the fund managers for BREF Fund Number One LLC, BREF Fund Number Two LLC, BREF Debt Capital LLC. We are social impact private equity real estate funds that raise capital exclusively from black accredited investors and deploys that capital exclusively with black real estate entrepreneurs like Larry Thomas in black neighborhoods to build wealth and create jobs for black people. For more information on how we can invest in your real estate project or how you can invest in our real estate fund, please visit us at blackrealestateforum.com blackrealestateforum.com. Today we are in the Level Town section of Long Island. Level Town section of Long Island. So tell, tell us about this property here. Thank you. So this property we purchased for, um, it's a single primary home here in the Level Town area. Our goal is to demolish the entire property and go new construction from grounds up and probably do about 34 to 3,500 square feet. Five bedrooms, four and a half bath, open concept, large windows, high ceilings, and just to make it a really great property in this area to add value to the consistent area that's growing here in Levittown. So uh, how much did you acquire the property for? So we acquired this property for $470,000. Our goal is to put in this property about four to $500,000 and be able to sell it on the market for about $1.2, $1.5 million. And this is you and your partner, Ascari My partner, Foy. Ascari Foy. We're both, again, Venture Alliance Real Estate Enterprise. And what we do, we also kind of, you know, work with Thomas and his team and, you know, put funds into these communities and in these projects that we have here. So let me ask you, uh, I know it's it's not difficult for property owners to get debt. Uh, how challenging it is for you to find equity investors? And how important it is that black lawyers, black doctors, and black investment bankers and other black uh, entrepreneurs are investing in our fund and then we're able to pull that capital to invest. Uh, we're going to be investing $100,000 in this project with Larry. How important it is as a, as a, as a black uh, real estate entrepreneur to identify this type of capital for your for your business? No, that's a great question because that, that is one of the biggest struggles as a African-American investor in this market, right? If we had a community like Thomas is developing with his funds, if we had a great community that we can all pool our funds together with a promising return that he gives to his investors, we would have so much more leverage in these markets to be competitive and to also expedite our products a lot faster than we do now. So to answer your question, it is extremely important that we continue to pool our funds together, work with funds like yourself, and be able to consolidate our resources to be more powerful in this market. Yes, and I, so I'm going to tell you a dirty little secret. I don't want you to. I don't want you to tell anybody. This is between us, okay? okay. And the camera. <laughs> oh, I didn't even realize they were there. We are actually more than just a private equity real estate fund. The dirty little secret. This, this is between us. Okay. 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 All right. Our, we want to create jobs for black men to work so we can lower the incarceration rate in our community because one of the things that our Jewish friends, our Asian friends, our Indian friends, and our Arab friends have done so successful is that they, um, they are able to hire the people and keep them out of jail. For instance, in New York City, 90% of the inmates in the city jail are black and Hispanic, but black and Hispanics only make up 52% of the city's population. So we want to do what our Jewish friends, our Asian friends, our Arab friends, and our Indian friends have done very successfully, create wealth for their people and create jobs for their people. And that's very important. So I just think, yeah. so the work that you're doing is critical. I want to know, I want you to know, particularly I'm speaking to our investors, because of your money, we're able to invest in this entrepreneur, this black entrepreneur's project, and then he is able to hire black men and black women who are going to be doing the work, uh, um, building and, and creating this so that they can make significant value. Uh, that's, uh, it's not pretty inside. <laughs> so, um, you know, we're gonna go take a look inside, but we're gonna come back with a second video so we can see the progress report. Let's go take a look inside.
So, oh God, this place stinks. So it has a really nice backyard. And what's the lot size? The lot size is 8,500 square feet, and it's a corner lot, which gives it a great value for this, this, this um, community as well. Okay, so let's take a look upstairs. So you're, you're tearing everything down to the studs. Everything will be down, not to the studs, just to the foundation. Oh, to the foundation. So the slab so that's will everything. take everything down. Correct. Nice roof job. <laughs> All right, come over here. So, uh, thank you for giving us a tour, Larry. No, definitely. Very much. We need you to invest. We need black people nationally to come together so that we can build wealth and create jobs in the black community. We can only do this if we work together. So please visit blackrealestateforum.com, blackrealestateforum.com. Thank you and have a good day.